When I first find out that my daughter Sylvia had dyslexia, I felt very confused. I felt guilty. I thought it was something that I could have done to change it. an idea of what dyslexia was. So I started informing myself. I went to the website and I asked people around. I asked the counselors at school. I asked the doctors and then I realized that it's not something impossible to live with. I learned how to help her and support her in every way. I'm very, very proud of her. I, I wish this can inspire somebody who's out there thinking, oh my God, I have dyslexia, I can't, I can't read, I can't do this or I can't do that because that's not true. You can do a lot of things. The most important thing I had to do was inform myself. I didn't know anything about it. I didn't even know dyslexia existed. So I have to read a lot, I have to go to the website, I have to ask people around. And after that I have to, I had to talk to my other kids and make them understand, explain them what dyslexia was so we can all be a team and support Sylvia in every goal in life and be there for her every time she needed it. This is good. I will tell them to be very patient. There is a lot of things you can do to help your child. You, you probably have to repeat yourself or read them, read to them twice or explain them twice. But it's not impossible. You can do that and, and that means a lot to them. They, they really rely on you. They, they're waiting for somebody there to give them a little push so they can succeed in life. That's all they need. One of the biggest things for me when I first found out my daughter had dyslexia was finding out about the LD.org website where I relate to a lot of parents who have been in the same situation. I, I feel like a lot of them were saying just what was happening at home. What, they feel exactly how I felt, and, and, and I didn't feel alone anymore. I feel like there was somebody out there going through the same situations, going through the same panic attacks of thinking, I don't know what to do. I don't know how to like, push my child to keep going and to stay in school and, and have goals for their life. And once you read that and you find out that you're not the only one out there, you realize that your child can do a lot.